to my channel today i'm going to give you like a step-by-step -step documentation on the processes involved in the oh my god hello today i'm going to give you a video showing the step-by-step -step processes that was involved in our bringing up of the yolk sac lever that we had some time back. Remember, I did a video on hashing, so I documented all the processes involved. And then how I'm caring for the yolk sac lever up to fingerling stage now. So I'm going to give you hey. the phone. Yeah, the phone, yes. Is it? Are you showing the shaking inside here? It's not showing. Not go with your phone for water. Oh. If you go no, put it for water. Get the blocker, eh? mm. They will begin come at well now. Mm. I guess you can see them so tiny, 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 tiny. They are like worms. This is the third day after spawning, and we are doing a flow through. To clean the water you can see there's net at the edge there to prevent the fry from escaping and that little stone you are seeing there is to control the pH so this is what float is about water coming in and it's going, going out the fact is that you should be careful so the one going out is not more than the one coming in you can see some greenish substance those are eggs that are not um, hashed and they will likely pollute the water so we are going to control that you are shaking my video it's the care of the frame that will go rework anyway i'm doing a documentation for you to see hope you learn this is day two of the hashing and uh, now they are clustering at the edges. Try to zoom in for you. <laughs> yes. By the time they finish clustering, all the ones in the middle they will go to the edges. We can then siphon. And there you go. You see the yeah. Side, and there you go. This is the fall of hashing uh, egg of uh, catfish and. Yeah. The yolk sac lever are more visible as you can see now. Actually, it's in lava. You see how tiny they are, like worms. So, this is day four. We are doing float through. I actually started feeding them yesterday. We we'll want to do slow through before we feed them today. They have, you can see some of them swimming. Siphony has already been done from the ashy tanks, but we also siphoned some yolk sac lever into this bowl. So we are trying to get them out by siphoning the dirt out from the basin. 
This is day seven of hashing and the fry are finally out. Oh, it's not easy. No, let's see. Come on. Do you know the quantity of food to be done? You can't get a bandage. Okay. 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 So you're going to see the particles that they pursue them, they pick them, they eat. Uh, so on the sink, go down. So those ones are they down, you can see those ones they eat. They're almost two weeks old. People are not giving them breasts now. What are you going to feed them? What are you doing? Without foreign feet. Ah, see, shoot up! Hey! Je suis en train de me faire un truc. Mais ce sont des like three. How many weeks now? Four weeks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yes, uh, this is Jonathan. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Hope by now you have an idea of what it takes to uh, raise uh, fish from the lava stage to fingerling. So um, if you need me for consultation or anything, send me a mail on axtosan at gmail.com. Then uh, if you are new here, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and like the videos. Have a blessed day. Bye. Bit by bit documentation of how we raise the fry. Thank you so much. Hey. You the show? You the see one? Oh my God. I told you that today.